I'm here with Michael from AI Partners. Michael, what problem are you trying to solve here? Helping companies comply with the EU AI Act, specifically helping them identify and risk classify their AI systems with the use of our RegTech platform. So these are new regulations that are coming in. Talk to me about what they will mean for companies and businesses around the world. It's a new regulation on AI, which affects anyone using, developing, or deploying an AI system in the EU. Whether you're an Australian mining company or a US portfolio company, if you have exposure to the EU, like GDPR, and you'll need to comply with this. And the main aim for this is to make sure that any AI system is uh, trustworthy and safe and secure to protect EU citizens, specifically their fundamental rights and uh, values. So what do you offer companies trying to navigate these new incoming AI regulations? So we offer them consultancy. So we work with CMS, one of the world's largest law firms. And we offer a reg tech platform that allows them to do the risk assessments. Is there a level of complexity here? Why do they need uh, external expertise to comply with these laws? Well, this is one of the most complex areas of the, the technology here is very complex. Uh, technically, you have people uh, doing a lot of uh, upskilling. Uh, AI literacy is becoming a thing. And the per system assessment, we've estimated that without the system, they take you between five to eight hours with ours, 15 to 30 minutes. And the level of complexity, you're looking at significant costs also if you don't use the platform. So for us, it's a, it's a no brainer for us to help companies ultimately achieve AI, AI compliance in the most effective and efficient manner possible. Do you have a, a case study or, or a specific client that you've worked through that could be a good example for our audience? Obviously, I can't mention any names, but I think the professional service community is very well positioned because of their uh, position as sort of arbiter of trust to enable them to offer a solution to their clients that they can run through the AI systems and make sure that they deal with the consultancy element as well and to make sure they do the risk assessment so I think gener generically speaking, the professional services sector is a great example of how this tool could be used in practice. When do these new laws come into effect and how much time does the business community have to comply with them? Great question. There's a two year transition period where they have two years to comply with the complexity and myriad of problems. And we're here to help. Thank you so much. Thank you, Joanne.